yogis. Welcome to 10 Minute Tuesday. I'm Yogi Amy. Thank you so much for joining me. Today we're going to work uh, quickly in a more of a vigorous type of a flow. And we're going to add some core into that too. So I have got some weights. You don't need them. They're optional. Same with the block. Uh, completely optional. So I hope you enjoy this video. There are many more 10 minute videos on my YouTube page. So please feel free to find those videos, like my videos, comment on them, share. I love connecting and I love teaching yoga. So every little bit helps. All right, yogi. Sweep the arms open, inhale. Exhale, hands through the heart. Two more big deep breaths. Hands are gonna stay at our heart. We're gonna twist over to the right as we pop the right heel. Keep going with that. You want a little bit more. You can bring that knee up. You want more. Come to a chair as you twist. Starting to breathe. Sink the weight back into that left heel. Switching sides to that left side now. Breathing in and breathing out. You got it. Two more. Arms go wide. Lift that right leg up and tap. Again, you can bring in a chair if you'd like. Arms can really be wherever you would like them to be. Make sure that booty is sinking back. Belly pulling in. Other side. Feels good. Three, two, one. Sweep the arms open. Right hand, left wrist, side bend. Up to the center. Over the other side. Inhale up and exhale forward fold. Take that halfway lift. Inhale. Let's step back to our plank pose, pressing through our hands, engaging through the back of the body here. Finding that nice calm breath. Press back down dog. Go ahead and lift that right leg up. Inhale. Exhale, right knee, right elbow. Shoot the leg back. Same thing, right knee, right elbow. Shoot the leg back. This time we're going to hold right knee, right elbow. Bend the back knee so it hovers. Breathing. Lift that right knee higher. Breathe. Tucking everything up and in. Shoot that right leg back. Three-legged dog. Bring it all the way through. High crescent lunge. Ten toes point forward. Come on up. Inhale. Hands through the heart, exhale, twist, left elbow, right knee. Inhale, reach up, maybe up and back. Exhale, twist. Keep going there, yogis. That back knee can be down for a little bit more stability. Really pull the belly up and in. On that exhale. Last one. High press and lunge, inhale, hands go down to the floor, step back, high plank, breathe. Belly pulling in, exhale, lower all the way down to the ground, please. Bring your arms out in front of you, take an inhale, and on the exhale, go ahead, lift everything up, squeeze into the back of the body, inhale, lift, exhale, goal post the arms, lift the feet as wide as you can, inhale, forward, exhale, back. Three more. Last one. Lower down, press back with child's pose if you need it. Otherwise, we're gonna meet in that down dog, that left leg a lift, inhale. Left knee, left elbow. Few more, find that breath, a little bit of recovery. Next time we're gonna hold that left knee to the left elbow, hover the right knee, and lift the left knee higher, and breathe. Press that floor away, puff up to the back of the heart. Three like a dog, inhale. Bring that foot all the way through. 10 toes point forward, high crescent lunge. Hands to your heart. Left hip forward, left hip back, right hip forward. Inhale, reach up and back. Exhale, twist, right elbow, left knee. Keep going with that. Inhale, get big. And exhale, release. Few more. Last one. High press and lunge. Hands go down to the 
floor, step back, high plank, breathe. Take that right foot, step it out and in. You can tap or you can let it hover. Your back knee can be down. Three more. Nice job, other side. Three, two, one. Lower all the way down to the floor, arms out to the side. Nice and long like a T. Take an inhale. On the exhale, lift everything up, yogi. Squeeze into the back of the body, breathe. Now bend the knees, bring the big toes together. Lift those heels up higher. Lift the hands up higher. Breathing. Drive the heels up one more inch. Lowering down, press back, child's pose, down dog. We're gonna go ahead and transition onto our backs. You can grab those weights if you want them. Feet up, I'm gonna take the weights and bring them behind me, anchoring my hands down. Feet up, we're just gonna drive the feet straight up, straight up, straight up, and then maybe add that leg lower. Keep that low back on the floor. Try not to use momentum here. Try to really focus on that core. A few more. Last one. Bring the legs straight up above. Bring the hands into your chest. Actually, elbows by your side. We're gonna go ahead and lift up. Bring, twist both elbows to the right. Extend the weights. Bring them back. Twist to the other side, extend, bring them back, twist. Now your knees can be bent here. Getting little bicep curls here. Toes can be on the floor. Just twisting and extending those weights. Two more to each side. Nice job, release those weights. Go ahead and work your way up to a down dog. Breathing as you transition, you got this. Looking to the hands, bring the feet to the top of the mat. Halfway lift, inhale, and exhale, forward fold. Go ahead, sweep those arms open, come on up, inhale. Hands to your heart. Inhale, sweep the arms open, interlace all 10 fingers, release the index finger, bend over to the right. Kick the left toe out, bring the elbows to the knee, and breathe. If you want weights here, grab your weights. A little bit more resistance, super challenging. Breathing in and breathing out. Nice job, last two. Bring your feet back, reach up, go ahead and lean the other direction. Point the right toe out when you're ready. Elbows to knees. Keep breathing. That weight really makes a difference. Squeeze the elbows in. Five, four, three, two, and one. Release forward fold. And then we're gonna find that block if you have it or not. If you have it, put it in between your shins. Everybody meet in the high plank. Got two more minutes, we got this. Squeeze that block, really squeeze, pull the belly up and in. Walk your hands lightly back to the toes, squeeze the block, come on up, inhale, exhale back down. Walking on out, plank, squeeze, coming back, inhale up, exhale down. Now maybe add a chaturanga, halfway lower, press back up, we got two more. Chaturanga, press back up, whole planks. Now we're gonna go to side plank. If you have the block, it's going to be extremely challenging. If you don't have the block, it's gonna be extremely challenging. So just pick a side, squeeze that block if you have it, all the way to the other side. Side plank. Nice job, lower all the way down to the floor. 
Bend the knees, place the hands right by the chest, head to the floor. Now lift those heels up, up. It's a really small movement. Just getting into that low back a little bit more. Four, three, two, one. Press back, child's pose. Taking those big, deep breaths. Trying to change our focus from that negative dialogue to more positive and empowering. Walk your hands over to the right, please. Breathe. And then over through to the other side. And then through to the center, walk yourself to a seat, soles of the feet together, lift up nice and tall, inhale. And exhale, start to drop your body down, finding those calming breaths, balancing out that vigorous flow. Just come to a seat, yogi. Sweep the arms open on an inhale. Twist to one side, exhale. Just like that, side to side. And then so let's just join our hands together in front of our heart to thank ourselves for taking this time. It really does make a difference, yogis. It starts here with you. So thank you for taking the time to practice. It helps if you like, comment, and share any of my videos to get this word of yoga out to everyone. So thank you for all that you are and all that you're not. Peace in and peace out.